This is an order for Copland on Thursday evening, October 14th. We begin on page 127 in the Book of Common Prayer. We'll take just a few minutes to quiet our hearts. The Lord Almighty grant us a peaceful night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. Let us confess our sins to God. Almighty God, our Heavenly Father, we have sinned against you through our own fault, in thought and word and deed, and in what we have left undone. For the sake of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, forgive us all our offenses and grant that we may serve you in newness of life to the glory of your name. Amen. May the Almighty God grant us forgiveness of all our sins and the grace and comfort of the Holy Spirit. Amen. O oh God, make speed to save us. O oh Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Hallelujah. The psalm for this evening is Psalm 75, found on page 691. We will read this in unison. We give you thanks, O God. We give you thanks, calling upon your name and declaring all your wonderful deeds. I will appoint a time, says God. I will judge with equity. Though the earth and all its inhabitants are quaking, I will make its pillars fast. I will say to the boasters, boast no more. And to the wicked, do not toss your horns. Do not toss your horns so high nor speak with a proud neck. For judgment is neither from the east nor from the west, nor yet from the wilderness or the mountains. It is God who judges. He puts down one and lifts up another. For in the Lord's hand there is a cup full of spice and foaming wine, which he pours out, and all the wicked of the earth shall drink and drain the dregs. But I will rejoice forever. I will sing praises to the God of Jacob. He shall break off all of the horns of the wicked, but the horns of the righteous shall be exalted. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Be sober, be watchful. Your adversary, the devil, prowls around like a roaring lion, seeking someone to devour. Resist him firm in your faith. Thanks be to God. In your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit, for you have redeemed me, O Lord, O God of truth. Keep us, O Lord, as the apple of your eye, Hide us under the shadow of your wings. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Together, let us say the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord, hear our prayer and let our cry come to you. Let us pray. Look down, O Lord, from your heavenly throne and illumine the night with your celestial brightness, that by night as by day, your people may glorify your holy name through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen.
Together on page 134, let us say together. O oh God, your unfailing providence sustains the world we live in and the life we live. Watch over those both night and day who work while others sleep and grant that we may never forget that our common life depends upon each other's toil. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. At this time, you may unmute yourselves for prayers either silently or aloud. Pray for Kathy and Tracy and all involved with the fair. Amen. Kathy and for Doris. For Jordan and Trey and Sarah. And you to healing for Pam. For Becky. And Darby and Jim's mother. And Darby's friends. For John. For Larry, Alice, and Sarah. Bay Cooper's sister, Moxine, who died on Sunday. For Becky McDonough and Susan and Dan Duke. For Jim Logan's mother. For Darby's friend. We lift all these prayers up in your name. Amen. 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 We continue on the bottom of page 134. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Lord, you now have set your servant free. Go in peace as you have promised. For these eyes of mine have seen the Savior, whom you have prepared for all the world to see, a light to enlighten the nations and the glory of your people Israel. Glory to the Father and to, <clears throat> the, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. Lord, we pray today for all nations, and especially for places where there is persecution, where there is violence, and where there is indifference, anxiety, and alienation that the whole world would come to know your healing love. King of peace, who longs for us to live in fellowship and unity, send your spirit of peace throughout our world. Take from our hearts all prejudice and envy. Take from our hands the weapons of violence and take from our lips all words of cruelty, that we may live as brothers and sisters, one family in the love of your son, Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. The almighty and merciful Lord, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, bless us and keep us. Amen. Amen.